It can be super duper overwhelming to know where to start when it comes to building healthier habits to help with weight loss. There are so many options, so many lists, all these things that we can do. So I thought I would share with you my top three healthy habits for 2023. My name is Cola. I am certified as a personal trainer, nutritionist, I'm a wife, I'm a mom, and I am here to help us all get our lives. Welcome back to my lovely Coco Puffs. I love you so much and you are the reason I am here. Maybe you should let me love you. Let me be the one to help you lose all the weight you don't want. Number one, sleep early. Number two, exercise every day, Monday through Friday for at least 10 minutes a day. Number three, eat more plants. Those are my top three healthy habits for 2023. Think about it this way. You've probably heard of the Pareto principle, which is the principle that states that 20% of your actions are responsible for 80% of your results. These three action items are the 20% that can help us produce the 80% of the energy and weight loss that we're looking for. The first one I want to talk about is just moving for 10 minutes or more every single day. This is one that is very challenging even for me to do. For example, we recently had bad weather in Texas and I had to skip a few days of my workouts. And no, I didn't try to then catch up on later days. Listen, yesterday was yesterday. That was in the past. Today is a new day. Today we do better. That's the way to go. At least that's the way I try to live my life. I'm not going to sit here today and be mad about the workout I missed yesterday. My point is the intention is to do this every single day, Monday through Friday, five days a week. I do my best to get it done. Sometimes I may have to miss a day. That's okay. I continue the next day. I don't let that one day I miss be the reason that I now stop the habit altogether. I'm human. I miss days as well, but I keep going. I still try. I move on. The next day I'm gonna show up and I'm gonna do my best. The thing with eating plants is this one is the one that I am very passionate about in the sense that whenever people talk about eating plants, we often talk about eating plants in terms of how to make them taste better. And I'm here on behalf of the plants. This is sounding crazy, but I'm just here to say that maybe we don't need to make plants taste better. Hear me out. Maybe we just need to eat them. And then I'm in two minds because I'm like, but at least they're eating the plants. Even if all the vitamin C has died, have you ever eaten Nigerian vegetable stew? We boil the spinach so much, it changes color. It's not even green anymore. It's like mush, <laughs> but it's so delicious. I'm honestly in two minds. I am conflicted in this moment. You know what? Do what you want. Which brings me to my third habit, which is sleeping earlier. This is one that has been really challenging, but also so rewarding. Every day I sleep an hour or an hour and a half earlier than I was last year. You know how I'm able to do that? I've told everybody in my life to stop stressing me out. Every last one of them. Because if you stress me, trust you will be dealt with. <laughs> I'm just saying boundaries are beautiful and I have learned some boundaries, man. I wish I had confetti. It's so life-changing. You're a different person when you sleep. When you sleep more, you eat less, you have more energy to move, people are happier to be around you because you're just more fun, more relaxed, you joke more, and it's just a happier time. Is it easy to get to that point of sleeping more? Absolutely not. It's not easy to change habits, but it can be done. And if one of your healthy habits for 2023 is to move more you need to move your fingers to kabokofitness.com take the quiz i got lots of quizzes pumping out on my site they're so fun take the quiz see what's up and see if my workout programs are right for you 